The Rolling Stones' first shared apartment was located at 102 Edith Grove in Chelsea, London. This modest flat near the trendy King's Road became the band's creative hub during their early days. When Mick Jagger, Keith Richards, and Brian Jones moved in together in 1962, the apartment became famously chaotic, with piles of unwashed dishes, stale food, and clutter that barely left the space habitable. This grimy yet lively atmosphere reflected the raw energy and scrappiness that would come to define the Stones' early sound. Living in Chelsea, so close to the fashion-forward King's Road, exposed the band to a unique mix of artistic and countercultural influences. Absorbing this scene added a distinct style and rebellious flair to their public image, one that would shape the bad boy persona they became known for. While Edith Grove wasn't where they wrote any of their major hits, it played a crucial role in shaping their sound and identity. It was here that Jagger, Richards, and Jones immersed themselves in American blues, jazz, and rock and roll, drawing inspiration from legends like Muddy Waters, Howlin' Wolf, and Chuck Berry. Countless hours were spent jamming, refining their sound, and playing cover songs that would become staples in their early live sets. This period laid the foundation for their debut album, The Rolling Stones, 1964, which prominently featured covers of classic blues tracks. Though their most iconic originals, like I Can't Get No Satisfaction and Paint It Black, would come later, Edith Grove was where Jagger and Richards first began experimenting with songwriting and developing the chemistry that would drive the band to global fame. The apartment's gritty influence became part of the Stones' mythology and was later immortalized in their 1965 UK album, Out of Our Heads, whose artwork reflected the raw and unpolished image the band was cultivating. In 2016, the exhibitionism show at London's Saatchi Gallery even recreated the infamous Edith Grove apartment, allowing fans to experience the chaotic creative energy that permeated their early years. Today, 102 Edith Grove remains a symbolic landmark for Stones fans, representing the grit and passion of a young band on the brink of rock and roll stardom.